Countries in the Sahel region of Africa are facing chronic drought, which human rights advocates say is causing a severe food crisis. In Chad, humanitarian experts estimate tens of thousands of children will experience malnutrition and hunger this year. For more, UN Radio's Derek Mabatha spoke with Bruno Mais with the United Nations Children's Fund. Is there a threat of children dying of malnutrition in Chad now? Yeah, if we don't do anything from now, we estimate that 127,000 children will die. 127,000 children the age of 6 to 59 months. And the total number of children in the Sahel Band is 1,100,000 under 5. Now tell me, Mr. Mas, what is UNICEF doing to help these vulnerable children in Chad? Basically, the first key action is to ensure a treatment of children with severe acute malnutrition. Last year, we had around 223 UNICEF-supported nutritional centers for treatment of severe acute malnutrition in the Sahel Band. But this year, we will have to increase and expand the number of therapeutic nutritional centers to ensure a better coverage. We hope to go up to 270 nutritional centers. And this will be translated in ensuring that all the therapeutic milk essential medicine and ready-use therapeutic food are procured and distributed on time. UNICEF is also providing technical and financial support as well as search capacity for the treatment of severe acute malnutrition. Tell me about the $2.2 million that the UN Central Emergency Response Fund allocated to UNICEF to assist children there. For 2011, 223 UNICEF nutritional centers were operational due to the significant support of the Central Emergency Response Fund. Around 68,600 children were admitted for treatment of severe acute malnutrition in these 223 therapeutic feeding centers. Nearly 7,000 received inpatient care, while outpatient care was provided to the rest. How are these children now? Uh, Well, these children survived due to this appropriate treatment. The operation was a success and in coordination with World Food Programme, who was also providing support for the management of moderate acute malnutrition. That was Bruno Mais with the United Nations Children's Fund speaking to UN Radio about the food and nutrition crisis in Chad.